I just saw the saddest news. The saddest news. You emerging from that place. That place of mutilation. And the emergent you I did not recognize. That face. That once beautiful face that I had spent hours of joy reading. Its lines and between its lines. I could not recognize. I used to tell time by that face. Time to laugh with madness. Time to sing in ecstasy. Time to radiate joy. Time to weep to emptiness. Now that face, that once beautiful face, is a broken clock and the smile that spread like an eternal dawn is a slither of ice floating on the surface of a dead martini. I want to grasp you by the hand. I want to engulf you in completeness and ask why? Why did you believe them? Why did you take notice of their lies? Why did you go this way into this defacement camp? I want to storm its corridors and besiege its caverns and steal back the crow's feet wrinkles that crinkle the corners of your starlight glimmer eyes. I want to search through the buckets and steal back the lines that showed me where you had been, that showed me how it had been, that showed me what could impossible be, that impossible could be. The lines that taught me, that wrenched open areas in my heart and mind that I had not dared, would not have dared without those lines. And I want somehow to paste them back onto the face you forfeited to society's judgment, and then to take you back to where we had been and appreciate you more and never, not for one moment, allow you to doubt your inimitable beauty. But here we are, you with your brand new face, and me still in love with you, primed to read the story of your heart, 